Well, good morning, guys. Obviously, we didn't um, do some vlogging yesterday because um, we just had a chill down day. Um, well, we just wanted a day off from the camera room. Really. Turn yeah, right and then take the motorway. We've been really busy and stuff like that, so it was just nice to just chill and enjoy a bit of the view out there um, ourselves. Nice. And we had a good night last night. Um, Went for dinner at STK. Yeah. First time we've eaten there, and the steak was incredible. It was. I eat steak at home, but normally it's rump because well, steak's expensive, and we spend all our money on coming here, so we don't tend to splurge on steaks or stuff like that, do we? No. We tend to have quite basic, quite cheap meals, and so we can afford to come here. Yes. But, uh, yeah, we had the had steak last night and mine was just, wow, it was amazing. So we had um, this smoked, double smoked bacon, bacon with date chutney and dried tomatoes and crushed garlic. Which was very nice. Um, it was amazing. Was Delicious. Hold on a minute. Uh, Definitely would order that again. I consider going just for that to be fair. That Really, really good. Um, and then I had a New York strip steak, um, peppercorn. You had a. I had a fillet. Yeah, or okay. a fillet steak. <laughs> we just get calling it fillet, and that. no, no, it's fillet. <laughs> um, and we had that. I had peppercorns on mine. I didn't have a topping, but I had a chimichurri sauce. It's the first time I've had chimichurri. Um, really, really enjoy it. I'd definitely have that again. Um, we had a bit of an issue with my steak. Um, I asked for it well done, came out medium rare. You also asked for it butterfly, which it wasn't. Yeah. Um, so then they, um, so when I cut in it, it was obviously medium rare, I don't like that. I asked for it well done and butterfly didn't come like that. So then Pete um, called over some, called, who did he call over? He uh, called over the waiter. And asked to see the manager. Asked to see the manager. Oh no, he called over the waiter first and said that we asked it for well done. So he took my steak away. Nice. Um, then all that they did was throw the same steak back on, cooked it, and burnt it. Well, burnt it and then put it back on my plate and it what looks it me. disgusting. So then Pete said, uh, then he asked for the manager, he told the manager and he was like, I'll get that sorted just straight away and when I got it the steak was fantastic. So um, so yeah they need to work on the waiter service a little bit. Yeah the waiter was a bit slow but we had a great evening. Well, we had a, yeah. It was fantastic and it was just a really really nice evening so thank you again. Yeah um, and it was nice to meet you both. Um, and it was just a just a fab chilled night which which we needed. needed yeah and we totally enjoyed it so now today we're not too sure what today brings um, we're just going to be out there and just see wherever the sunshine state takes us for the most part we've done everything that we really wanted to do um, so for the last few days I think we're going to just sort Keep of left. see how we feel on the day, see if there's something we want to do again and just sort of yeah, see where see where we go. I mean today we're not even sure where we're going. Um, we've got the sat nav in for SeaWorld, um, so we're heading that way and we'll see what we do. I mean there's a couple of things that we still want to do before we go home. Yeah, we've not seen the One Ocean show yet, no. um, which one, because obviously they're going to be getting rid of that. Um, we've not seen Pets Ahoy, I've not done my Turtle Trek, um, and stuff like that. So we've got our new change as well, that, we're, that will pop in their conservation fund. Um, yeah, we need to see the quarters we've just been putting in a dish in the villa, and then today we'll whenever we well, we are going to see one today. So we'll just drop into conservation fund. We've only kept quarters in our wallets and on us because everything else is a bit too much like hard work. Um, and then what we're doing is um, 
I'd like to view the rescue bit as well. Yeah. Um, so yeah, After so, well, that's today really. Yards, so we'll um, try and keep you in the loop as much as we can. Well, we're here. We've um, approached SeaWorld, and it looks quite quite busy to be honest. Mm. It is a Saturday. Um, it's bank holiday weekend. Yeah, so the busier it is, it's, it's great for the park, to be honest with you. Um, yeah, not so great for wait times and stuff, I guess, but it's nice to see SeaWorld getting busier again. Yeah, so um, so we're going to see what we can... See. See, well, see. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, uh. So I'm just waiting for Liam, he's opening it back to the car as he's forgotten his wallet. So I've come through the bag check and the metal detectors, I'm just kind of waiting. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Waiting. Here he is, wallet in hand. Say hello to the lo oh, lovely people. Hi, lovely people. So we just managed to get our reserved seating for the shows. and um, We had it booked for the 1st of October, didn't we? Yeah. But because uh, we were doing Diamond Shamu and the Killer Whale Tour, we weren't really having time to get the shows done as well. Um, so they said come back, see if it will print off another day. She went and spoke to her manager and it uh, looks like she overrode it and got it done for us. So, which is great. My glasses look wonky. Not sure what's going on there. They do look really wonky. I look like I'm drunk. Do my glasses look wonky to you? No. They do in the camera. Look. They do. They do. the angle. Maybe. Anyway, we're off to find Turtle Trek. My favourite. Got a show on? They must be doing a tour. And Turtle Trek. So, Turtle Trek is um, a 3D cinema. And you go in in your life of the turtle and you can experience what they go through and stuff like that. And it's, it's my favourite. There's a manatee. Look, look a little baby. Get a closer look at the manatees in a second. So afterwards, you come through this room. Oh, look, they're in here. Don't go and see 
around that, but no. All these turtles are rescued. I'm not sure if you can hear, it's quite loud. One at the top there, two of that. Grandma Turtle, the big turtle that you saw, um, she's got no bottom mouth. So, um, so we are in Turtle Trek, and this is the dome. So it's a bit. We're not going to film any of this because it's 3D. Yeah, 3D. So we can't film it. Um, and it's my favourite, so I've only got one pair of glasses. But um, it can be a bit disorientating at the best of time, so... Yeah, because if I'm telling them, you really need a 360 camera if you want to record it all. Um, <laughs> so yeah, this is what it looks inside. So we've just come out of the... Um, turtle, turtle track? Turtle track? And obviously it's got me. It's really good. You can't describe it really. Being everyday hero. So if you get to, if you get to go and watch it then please do it. So now we're just going to go over to the viewing area and rescue and stuff and then we'll probably make our way to um, Pets Ahoy. Up to walk off, <laughs> sitting in love. So, this now is the bit that we never used to be able to see. This was all kept backstage, so it's not something they used to brag about, but. Obviously it's something they need to shout about now because people don't realise just how much good work they do. This is the reason why SeaWorld's here. Because if SeaWorld wasn't here, what would happen to that? Well, these would probably be dead now. Yeah. So the lady was just saying the two that are floating um, are here because they've been hit by boats which broken their ribs and punctured their lungs. So every time they take a breath, their whole bodies fill with air, which is why they're struggling to to float, they, they can't control their buoyancy, so they're just floating around at the minute. It's very early days, which says it's a case by case basis, and you just don't know how long it will take for them to recover. But uh, fingers crossed for them, they'll get better. So, after a bit of an emotional beating at Turtle Track and the Manatee Rescue bit, we're a Pets Ahoy! Ahoy! All these animals are rescued.
stalker. He told me what to do. He told me to. Not for very much longer. I've got to. 